Good morning, students. In today's class, we are going to practice NF. The word NF. NF is called a determiner in English language. This has the uses of uh, adverb and also adjective. Let us practice. The first example is as much as is necessary. The meaning of NF is as much as is necessary. When you say that the tea is NF, the books are NF, the topics are NF. You mean that you need something which is necessary. Let us discuss some more examples. There are enough books in the library. It means the books are enough for the students in the library. The menu is enough. It is necessary. The menu is necessary. That's enough. Okay. Now let us move to the next example. Quite enough. Quite enough. Enough of. More than enough. These three usages, they have the similar meaning. When you say that, quite enough. The topics for the seminar are chosen by your organizer or coordinator. The topics for the seminar are quite enough. It means more than is wanted. They are more than the required topics. There are enough of the topics. The topics are enough. The topics... Enough of the topics are there for the seminar. It means there are more than the required number of topics. See, the topics are more than enough. The mean, that means, we mean the topics declared are more than enough. More than is wanted. More than they are wanted, required. Okay, students. Coming to the next example. Enough now. Enough now means you are giving a limit. For example... Uh, you are giving a time limit of 5 minutes to the speakers in a debate or elocution contest or uh, some other contest. In that, the students or the participants, they are expected not to cross 5 minutes limit. So, after 5 minutes, if uh, they suppose cross, you can say, enough now. You mean, you have spoken enough now. Your time limit is over. You may be crossing. So, you give chance to the next participant. Enough now. Enough now means by this time you have crossed your limit. Time limit. Okay, let us discuss another example for this. Your father gives you 500 rupees as pocket money every month. You have spent it uh, by 28th of that month. Your father says you have spent enough now. The limit of your pocket money is over for the month. I will give you pocket money on 1st of next month. So, the limit, it indicates the limit. Coming to the next thing, enough times, that's enough. That means, you want the other person to stop. You don't want the, a particular thing anymore. So, enough times and that's enough, these two usages are similar. Suppose the boys are practicing the game number of times, you can say, you have played enough times, you stop now. That's enough, you stop now. Because you have had enough practice for today. So, you stop. See, coming to the sixth one, enough of this, enough already. It means, we don't more want any more, no more thing we require. See students, they had enough of the meetings this month. They don't want any more meetings. They want no more meetings. They had enough practice already. They don't need to practice anymore. They need practice. No, they don't need any more practice. So, when you indicate no more further practice is required or any quantity, any item is required, you can say, Enough of this, enough already. They had enough practice already in their maths for tomorrow's examination. They don't need to practice further. And they had enough of the meetings this month. They don't need to have any further meetings this month. They can have next month. Okay. Enough is enough. When you say that, when you, to, when you tell other person, enough is enough, you don't want to discuss it further. You don't want to argue it further. You had enough argument or you had enough... Uh, discussion with him or her or with other person. Okay, we discussed uh, enough. Enough is enough. 
as much as we discussed as of now, that's sufficient. Let's depart. Let us close it. Enough is enough. We had enough discussion. Enough is enough. We had sufficient discussion on this topic. Enough is enough. Let us close it now. Okay. Enough said. It's a formal way of using enough. Enough said means when the other person is exploiting something to you, he is explaining something to you. You understand it? You don't want the other person to explain it further. Because you already have understood enough. So, when you use enough said to the other person, it's formal way of uh, telling the other person that you understand what he means so that he doesn't need to explain it further. This is how we are using enough in different contexts. Very interestingly, though it looks like a very simple usage, this has uh, a very extensive uh, practice and applications. Please try to practice all of these usages. See students, when you say something is enough for you, the coffee is enough, the breakfast is enough, it is just sufficient for you. It is as, as much as necessary. The necessary thing that is what you had. What is necessary for you, you already had. You already have. Okay. Coming to the next one. When you use quite enough, enough of and more than enough. See students, quite enough. The menu is quite enough. It means it's more than what is required. And the topics that are announced for the seminar, they are more than enough. There are enough of the topics. It means the topics are more than enough. More than what, what is required. Okay, coming to the next one. Enough now. Enough now gives you a limit. So, you tell the other person. You have played enough now. That means you have given some time limit to him. Or in a debate you have given 5 minutes time or 6 minutes time to the speaker. So that you can say enough now when they have consumed their time limit. When you spent your pocket money, your father can say you spent enough now this month. So I will provide you the pocket money next month. Enough times and that's enough. When you want to tell the other person to stop from doing something. See, you had played enough times. Stop further playing. That's enough. That's enough. You played enough. And your practice is sufficient. You had enough practice. That's enough. You played well. That's enough. This is what uh, we mean in this usage. Fifth usage. And enough of this. Enough already. We want... No more from the other person. Suppose the other person spoke on this topic. Enough of this. Enough of this you mean you don't want uh, any further speech, extension of the speech from him. And when you had enough meetings, we had enough of the meetings this month. Enough already. They had enough practice already in mathematics for tomorrow's examination. They want no more practice. Next, enough is enough. When you cut short uh, the discussion between you and the other person, enough is enough. I don't want any more further discussion. Enough is en enough between you and me. I don't want any more further argument. And when you say enough said, enough said you are using it in formal context. So, when you say enough said to the other person, it means you have understood what the other person said to you. What the other person explained to you. So, he doesn't need to explain it further. So, this is how you are uh, using enough in different applications in very lively contexts. Keep practicing students. With this, I would like to conclude this session. All of you, subscribe my channel and give your valuable feedback in the comment section. I extend my acknowledgments to the Cambridge Advanced Learners Dictionary for all the references, for all the usages and meanings of this session. Thank you.